hi and welcome again so in today video we will explain how we can install mimic version 3 in a local postgres database on windows 10 first of all you need to install the postgres sql uh, so i would be leaving this is the link uh, where you can download the postgres i will leave it in the description below uh, so you can choose uh, so for a uh, version like 1304 it's available on Mac and Windows so you can install it either on Mac on Windows uh, so version 10 uh, yeah 10 or 18 it's available on Linux and Mac and Windows since we need to install it on Windows so I'm going to choose that 1304 uh, click download uh, it will be uh, downloaded and execute file so you just click and just click next 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 leave all the things uh, as it is uh, just one thing I need to mention during installing the database just leave the username which is by default postgres as it is so you can just change uh, your password you can select any password you want so the only thing you will have to change it is the password the second thing you will need you will need to access to the mimic code so i will be leaving uh, the github url for the mimic code so you can uh, basically you will have to go to the mimic tree then build uh, mimic uh, so uh, postgres and you will have to download all those scripts so once you download it combine them and put them on the C so what I'm did here I go to the C I create a folder called tools inside this tools I have mimic code masters and build mimic uh, postgres and I based all the uh, the codes okay the last thing you will need you will need the database so as this is private database and you cannot access the all the data so uh, we will we will download the demo so demo which is allow you to load some data so basically you will go to the this is the URL from where you can download the demo so basically you will go all the way down okay and just download the zip file here once you download it extract it once you extract it go to the folder where you bought the mimic code uh, next to this uh, I mean in the same folder you can uh, put the mimic database uh, demo all right, so now we have the Postgres install, we have all the Mimic code, and we have the Mimic uh, database demo, and we are ready to go. So the first thing you will have to go to the Postgres SQL, and we will open the SQL shell. Okay, now the server is localhost default. I will leave it as it is database name it's postgres i can uh, leave it as it is and port which is 5432 leave it as it is uh, username it's postgres as it is now you will have to enter your password okay once you success login you will see postgres equal hyphen and now we will running our command so the first thing we need to run as they saying in the documentation the first thing we will need to creating a uh, database so the first thing will we need to uh, it drop the database if it is exist so we will be running this command here drop database if exist so they say okay database mimic does not exist skip so which is mean it not exist so now we will creating a database running this command creating database mimic on our postgres now database uh, the database is created 
I will be I will be leaving all uh, the link for the uh, documentation so you can follow in case you need you can just copy paste the command. Next, we need to connect to Mimic database. We were running this command. Okay, make sure when you writing this command, make sure it is it is backward slash not forward slash back backward slash. So enter. Now you are you are now connected to database mimic mimic as user Postgres. So now you are connect to database mimic as user Postgres. Now we will have to create the schema to hold the database. So the command is create schema mimic three. Okay, so let us just uh yeah do it create and since it is demo so we will we will add demo okay great so now we're creating the schema mimic demo so now we will have to inform postgres that if that it should be default uh use the mimic 3 demo schema so we're running this command set search underscore bat to mimic three underscore demo and it's run success now we will creating the tables under the schema so we will running uh, the script which is postgres underscore create underscore tables um, underscore sql so this is this is all the codes we have so we need to uh, running the postgres underscore create underscore tables dot sql this one here but we cannot just double click and running and execute the file because this is not mutable file so we have to run it uh, using the sql shell shell okay now it's saying create table okay okay now uh, we need to uh, prepare to load data into into the tables uh, we're running this command uh, set on error underscore stop one now we're running this command here set mimic underscore data underscore dir and then we located the the file the location file for the database demo so if you remember we installed here in tools mimic here now we can just copy the path and putting right here uh just i want to mention one more things here i noticed that is which is the which is the which is that if you copying the path as it is, you will see it is used uh, forward slash. But in 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 when you paste it here, you will have to change it from back from forward slash to back backward slash. So basically, you will change this one to forward. This one to forward slash. this one to forward slash then you can copy it then you can type um uh backward slash set mimic underscore data underscore uh, uh dir uh, between single quotation you will get you will put the path you can see here it is forward forward slash now click enter Okay. The second, the second thing we will need to run the Postgres load data SQL, which is allow us to load all the data now. Click. It's taking some time. 
okay it's done it's loading all the data now we build the indexes by running this command okay now it's done now we can running this command here to uh, uh, just to make sure like everything is creating correctly the data is loading okay running this one here and we can see here like uh, okay we have uh, uh, okay okay now we will run a test okay select uh, ICU stay underscore ID so we're running this uh, small query to make sure uh, the data is loaded and everything is working fine enter as you can see I got a result here and everything is working fine so another way you can uh, test you can go to the start then you can you can open the postgres admin which is bg admin for Okay, enter your bus wall. Mm -hmm. Okay, this server here. Okay, oh, okay, password is wrong. Type it again. Okay, database. I have two database here. I have mimic database, uh, Postgres database. So uh, if you go to the Postgres and go to schema, there is nothing here. So go to mimic go to schema here we can say mimic demo which is here and if we go to the tables here we can see it's all the tables so just make sure uh, the take patient here and just uh, right click and select the uh, view data like uh, first 100 row okay as you can see it's all the data is loaded and it's success to install mimic congratulations thank you guys for watching this video